Hey everyone and welcome back to another Easy Excel tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to quickly find and replace data in Excel. I'll show you how to do it manually using the regular find and replace function, and I'll also show you how to do it automatically using the Power Query Editor. Let's get started. You can see we have here our regular data set, essentially a list of Titanic passengers and some information about each of those passengers. You can see here in column E, we have their gender, M for male, and F for female. Not quite in the format that we want it to be in, so let's go ahead and do a find and replace. All you have to do is select E here to select the column. We're going to hit Control F on our keyboard, and let's go over to the Replace tab. Now we're going to find any M in the column, and we're going to replace it with male. Let's go ahead and click Replace All. Done. We'll do the same for female. Find any F and replace with female. Go ahead and hit replace all and we're done. So that's how we can do it manually. But let's say that this is a running list and we're constantly adding data to the list. We don't want to have to do this find and replace every single time. So what we can do instead is we can create a query in the Power Query editor to do it automatically. First thing as usual is to import our data into the Power Query editor. We're going to go over to our data tab here and select from table or range, hit OK. Let's give our table a name. And from here, we can create the step to automatically find and replace. So we'll go over to our column with the gender. And in our ribbon here under the Home tab, we'll go ahead and click Replace Values. Value to find is going to be M. We're going to replace with male. We can see that a step has been added here. And we'll add another step for female. Value to find F, replace with female. All right. We see another step was added here. Now, the great thing about Power Query is it will remember the steps. So every time you refresh your data, it will automatically follow the steps over here in the Applied Steps column. Let's go ahead and click Close and Load. And you can see here, it's working as expected. In column E, it found and replaced all the values that we wanted to find and replace. And the great thing about it is if you add extra data to your original data source, so your original table here, all you have to do now is go over to your Power Query table, right click, hit refresh, and it will automatically find and replace based on the instructions that you previously provided. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe, and I'll be back soon with more easy Excel tutorials.